Megan and I are here in the mountains and we're gonna just kind of search around and pick up some stuff and see what we can find so that we can make some stuff for our altar. I will literally fight you Good off luck. with my sticks. Good luck. <laughs> How many There's sticks do you have? This many. Oh, that's a really thick stick right there. Yeah, I mean, the you thicker can keep, the better. You can. Oh, okay. Keep <laughs> it. <laughs> Excuse me. You you can keep that stick. I'm, I think I'm gonna keep these sticks. Oh, those are cute. Yeah. So. But are they this one? We, no, <laughs> they are definitely not that one. <laughs> Okay, so you want to look for sticks that are about this size so that you can eventually snap them and I like tie one. them to. No, Megan. It's like a pitchfork. <laughs> Amazing. I don't think that's the right size. No, I really think this will like work as like seven sticks in one. All right, let's go. <laughs> Do you think I can't get that one right there? Do you think I can't get that stick right there? What stick? <laughs> that stick? Yeah, you think I go can't get, get it, that? Megan. Challenge accepted. Go get it. Go get that stick. Yeah, go get it. Go get it. Do it. Here, leave leave your other sticks here. No, no, these sticks guard oh. me. These are my guard sticks, so. I also want this one. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's go. <laughs> so we're gonna make our stick things. Sticky things. My stick things. I love so, sticks. I have these strings that you can use um, and we're just gonna like tie the sticks into little pentagrams. Perfect, I need to bring yeah. some of these. In or you can even use them in like different. Yeah, you can like actually make the sticks as small or as like big as you want because these are gonna be really big pentagrams if you decide to do that. Okay. So I might even break these like. Like I'm still working on a little bit. This one in half. Amazing. Like that. Doing this right? Nobody knows. No, probably not. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, cute. Yeah. So, you're a pro. You can use like whatever color you want. I think I might use. I'm gonna do. Yeah, I was thinking little striped colored ones. Yeah. <gasps> no, I like this one. This one's fine. There you go. Perfect. Oh, I need scissors. Excuse me. Um, not magic is pretty straightforward. You just think of an intention, and it's kind of like you can think of an intention or a straightforward mantra. And then you just, as you tie the knots, it's like you just kind of say it, it over and over. In yeah, your mind. it's like sealing that in. And if you want to get super fancy, you can like anoint the string, or um, you can do a specific amount of knots. Yeah. So. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So I'm gonna tie these together first. Just go one at a time. Yeah. Cool. I'm just gonna follow you. Okay. And we're just like in silence, like. How was your day? So how about them Broncos? No, we're not talking about the Broncos oh. again. <laughs> so those are really easy to do. And if you don't have string, you can also use hot glue. Like it doesn't have to be oh, like yeah. string. Oh yeah. I like I like the string though. I, I think it's like it kind of feels more personal. Like you're like more like you're kind of engaging with it as you're doing yeah, it. Yeah, I agree. Or you can make runes. If you're Oh, there you go. If you work with runes, you could definitely do that. So many options. Yeah, there's a lot of like alternatives. You can get really creative with just sticks and string. That's 
Yeah, that's a start. Yeah. I mean, it's not like you're going to be, like, throwing it around your room, so... Well, you don't know what I'm going to be doing with this. <laughs> that's true. That's... That's true. Never say never. <laughs> I'm guessing. I'm just going to reach over if you don't mind. I'm just going to grab that. Oh, yeah. Just help yourself. <laughs> understand anything happening right now. I'm just kind of, like, tying the sticks together in it. Yeah, I however I can. I'm not really... It's not, like... The aesthetic part isn't really my goal at the moment. It's just Mine's not either. Mine's just like to stick. To like make it, yeah. <laughs> getting it to stick. Oh my god, I have so much anxiety right now. Because they're sticks. <laughs> <laughs> Why did it take that long? I was like, what? I know, I was like, I don't think she's getting it. What do you mean? Because they're sticks, Megan. Yeah, like we're talking about sticks right now. I get it. Okay. <sighs> Finished it. I was like, how? I was like, done. <laughs> Which, <laughs> done. All right, so now I finished mine. I didn't. You're almost there, but I'm getting somewhere. Yeah, this one's yours. But, you know, what I'm saying is that if you wanted to, you could kind of, like, weave things in there and... That's really cute. You can, you can wrap the whole thing in string, too. It's... You can just get... Yeah, you could you could do the whole entire... Like, some people do, like, all of it. Oh, you know I've what I want somebody that. to do? Hmm. Is get really large sticks and wrap the whole pentagram or, like, whatever they make, oh. like a rune in Christmas lights or like fairy lights. What a good idea! That'd that would be so be really fun! Cute. On your front porch, like put it on your door. That'd be super cute, yeah. Be like, guess what? I think that'd be really cute. Or you can put this in the middle of your wreath. Because yeah, that, that's what I was thinking, like a wreath kind of yeah. thing. Yeah. Then it'd be a pinnacle. You can like add little, just like whatever Yeah, that's so sweet. You could put um inside to... You could put like pebbles or rocks or... Mm -hmm. Like, whatever you feel like you want to put in there. Let's do this. Like, when you did that earlier, she just put the stuff in the jar, and I was like, <gasps> amazing. Yeah, but my mom, like, does that all the time. I've learned from her. Whereas I, over I overthink a lot. I'm like, well, what could I put in this? But now I'm just, I'm just going to go for it. Sticks. Yeah, just, and if it doesn't work, take it apart. It's fine. Yeah, exactly. <gasps> Cute! Ta-da! <laughs> put little candles next to it. Yeah, and then you can put, like, little tea lights. Ooh. See? It's going to be so pretty. all the ideas. <laughs> You know what you could do is like, um, you could kind of just wrap it like this, like do different designs, but wrap it all the way, like kind of how it see through. Do you see what oh, I'm saying? Oh yeah, and you can also weave things through that too. Yeah, and then you, it's easier to put, I don't know if they can see that, but. Coming along, where's the top? There's, all the points are the top, it doesn't matter. <laughs> but I like kind of See like with your, oh, it's this with one. your like other stick, you could like hang it like that. With like, so you could hang it. Yeah, With yeah, like yeah. string here and then. You could also like put little something on there. Yeah. Like yeah. Or even like hang That's things like cute. this upside down next to it, you know? Love it. So it would look like. Like it'd be kind of like that. Grr. Oh, my food is done. Well, I'm delicious. Not. So hungry. Hi, I'm Meg, and this will be my very first time making an altar in honor of the winter solstice. So, uh, I've never made one, so I'm just gonna kinda wing it and show you guys what I am gonna do to kinda set it up. I'm still very new and learning new things. Um, it's gonna be hard without my coven mother here to guide me, but um, pretty much I live in a really tiny apartment, so, I wanted something to set it up on and I basically just found this side table. It's like an end table. I'm basically going to use that as the base to set the entire structure up. So I'll just walk you guys through it, I guess, and show you what I do. Mm -hmm. 